Hello, and welcome to Shelf Centered. Uh, this is Bryce, and um, I've developed a newfound appreciation for all these people that do YouTube. I have had to tape this like 100 times because I don't know what I'm doing, but you probably already knew that. Um, so, uh, as you can tell, I read books, or at least I collect them. You can't tell if I read them or not. You have no idea. Uh, but there's a bunch behind me. <laughs> um, so uh, what I uh, was thinking here, um, I am going to need a lot more practice, first of all. Where am I looking at? Am I really looking at myself again? Um, and I uh, just thought I'd go into a couple of the books I'm looking at, a couple of the books I'm reading, just some current reads, current interests, and... Uh, that's all we got from here. Uh, there's no real plan, as you will quickly find out. So don't forget to like and subscribe. I think that's what you're supposed to say. Uh, bookshelf behind me, check. Uh, I think I can do booktube now, right? Is it, it's allowed. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> so let's get off uh, the bat with a couple that I just... Uh, well, let's, let's start with what am I currently reading. Um... Uh, sci-fi. I'm big into the sci-fis. Uh, and Alistair Reynolds, one I read, Revelation Space, ages ago. And I think it was in law school. Um, and finally, picking back up where I left off, uh, trying to go publication order. So Chasm City? Chasm City? I keep saying both all throughout my reading, so correct me in the comments, all the people that are totally watching this. Um, and um, let's see. Uh, so that's technically right now, working through that um, and quite enjoying it. The the reviews are, are correct. I got junk on my shirt, apparently. Um, uh, next one, I brought my Kindle, but I didn't even get it ready. Maybe I can... You'll, my editing will be pathetic. Uh, but maybe I could pop a picture of what I'm reading up on the screen here. <laughs> now, clap. Um, but uh, the book that I am currently reading is Kurt Vonnegut's Slapstick. Uh, somehow, I think it was actually an accident because I didn't really know what Slapstick was going to be about. Uh, and now I'm reading two science fiction books. What I try to do is I always have like a Kindle book going, a physical book going, and an audio book at any given time. Sometimes more than that, I can't help myself. Uh, <laughs> I have no ability to stop this. Um, as we could see, Exhibit A. Um, so, uh, Slapstick, uh, it is a sci-fi. <laughs> Uh, and I guess a lot of what Vonnegut writes is sci-fi. Uh, I read quite a few of his. This is not my favorite, spoiler alert. Um, and I will probably do a review on it if I keep doing this. <laughs> Let's hope I do. Um, all right. Then uh, what I am, I kind of already started dabbling in this. Uh, I'm a cheater constantly. Um, but see, I try to get, I typically have like a fantasy book, then a science fiction going and maybe urban fantasy, but then also a classic or a nonfiction book. Um, I try to throw them all in, but I, yeah, primarily it's sci-fi fantasy uh, for me. Um, but I've been making my way through the Malazan. I say Malazan, I think it's wrong. I think it's Malazan, but I can't change it now. This is not happening and I don't want to, okay? You know what, I don't care. You know what, Steven Erickson, just because you made this whole world up and junk and ice, uh, I get to say what I want because uh, I'm the reader. Uh, so there you go. Um, all right, those are the books I'm kind of currently reading. Oh, audiobook, what am I doing? Um, oh, the phone is right there. Uh, this isn't, uh, I was going to like show it or something. I don't know what I'm doing, like I said. Um, maybe another thing, but fix it in post, right? Um, the what am I reading? Oh my gosh! Oh, second book in the Cradle trilogy, Soul Smith, because uh, Unsold was awesome, and uh, I'm really digging. Do I seriously still? This is how ghetto I am. Uh, I don't. What do I now know what I'm doing? Okay, um, yeah, awesome series. Really enjoying it. Kind of like 
Uh, if you know Andrew Rose, Arcanum Unbounded. No, <laughs> am I seriously saying uh, the Ascension? What is it? Dang, this is really way harder to do. I should keep notes. Um, Andrew Rose series about Ascension, something like that. Um, kind of like that. It's kind of like a video game ish. Um, people will probably slay me for that, but I, I really get this like video game, uh, kind of deal from it. Um, so let's see, those are the ones that I'm currently reading. Holy cow. I'm like I said, I have no self-control when it comes to books. Um, but I think I'm speaking to the crowd. Um, all right. Then what I am looking at in the near future, but as uh, I'm not like a, a Mike, Mike's book review, uh, who can keep to a schedule, which I am astounded. I lost that ability a long time ago. Man, you keep looking at myself. Stop that. <laughs> um, uh, so what I am looking at right now, and again, this is more in like, I kind of have like this pile on my bedside table uh, that is my uh, viewing for reading soonish and then sometimes it takes a year or more um but anyway what i'm looking at look at this is this is old school picked it up at like a library sale or something super cool uh actually the first four volumes i have is like these kind of i think original um but very cool looking wild cards this is the first one been meaning to read these for ages tell me something that not everyone has a issue with um okay other one i'm looking at um i uh, hear yo that's a sneak peek um so <laughs> i don't know what i'm doing do i know what i'm doing no um the answer is no um okay so this is a series that is a classic in fantasy you have to read it um and i'm loving it and i've only read the ones that are considered the worst ones i think um but i've been really enjoying them um Discworld. So this is what I'm on. Uh, book five. So we got a ways to go. I think there's like 39 or something, maybe more, 40 something. Anyway, I own like, can we see? There's a bunch ish right there. Um, anyway, ton up there. Uh, more on my, on my Kindle. Um, but slowly making my way through the, luckily they, I mean, they're, they made for essentially you can one shot them put them down for a while, come, uh, come back, you know, so book five, that's where I'm at book five. Um, and again, trying to go through publication order actually. Um, so what I was thinking, my thought is if, if others are better then I didn't want to like read them first and then be disappointed with some, I'll just gradually get more and more, uh, happy about things and stuff. Is that what, it, gosh, how do I not know how to word anymore? Um, I, uh, <laughs> so there's that and I will keep making my way through that. Cause I, I really like Terry Pratchett so far. Um, and I was told like, um, what's it, what's it called? Uh, luckily there's a nice, hopefully I'm not making it, having issues here. Uh, I was told equal rights was people's less than favorite. Um, the witches kind of arena but i love that was probably my favorite one of the first four that i've read um uh granny weatherwax is that what it is am i am i throwing um good omens in there no wonder people always have all these edits you know i'm learning a lot in just a very short time uh because of how terrible i'm doing anyway um all right a couple new ones that i picked up this one i picked up because of moid from the media death cult is that what it is uh i forget if it's something else now um uh, media death cult i know he had a little change but loving moid i like a sense of humor um but he's been talking about this one for a while so i found it it's got an introduction by christopher priest whom i love uh and uh yeah so i mean two good things going for it so far moid's recommendation christopher priest gonna gonna have to probably read that i don't know i'm not gonna make any promises uh other one this was too good of a deal uh not to pick up i love me some oscar wilde he is a little controversial if you look 
deeper into him. I like his quotes. I like his writings. Um, and uh, picture Dorian Gray for some reason I've been meaning to read for ages. I even got it on audio, but I started it on audio, and it was just one of those where I, there's too many like lines that you want to quote, and audio is just not good for being able to quote things. So I picked it up. I thought a fancy version of it will stoke the fires of me actually reading it someday. <laughs> okay, yeah, I mean, I've said that before. Um, anyway, uh, let's see. Uh, other things, um, well, I don't know. I think that's about it for now. I don't know what I'm doing, as I said a uh, hundred times already, uh, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look forward to seeing how this goes. Um, I'm... <laughs> Goodreads down on the thing. Um, uh, other links, but there won't be. Don't uh, don't pay me for anything. Nobody's going to want to. Um, I, I just you know would really appreciate like, subscribe, get me going, help me going, and I'll make more terrible <laughs> videos like this. Um, and you know what? Burn me, burn me. You have a good day. Okay. <laughs>